Hey everyone, welcome back to another Magic Minute. Today I'm gonna to show you how to use one of my favorite tools, the Chat with Docs tool. Recently in the news, you may have heard, the state of California passed a bill basically requiring teachers to teach AI literacy in their classrooms. Now as a former educator myself, I can tell you teachers probably don't have time to read the entire bill. So I'm gonna show you how to use the Chat with Docs tool to make this a little bit easier for you and pretty much create cliff notes on the fly. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go up here to the search bar and I'm gonna type in chat so I can find the chat with docs tool. Once in, you can see that there are two places where I can actually attach a document to have a conversation with. So the first thing I'm going to attach is the PDF of the bill itself. So here I can click the paper clip, go to upload PDF, and find the bill. So the second thing I'm going to attach is this artificial intelligence toolkit or resource kit that the Department of Education in the state of California released. So now I have the actual bill itself and the resource kit both attached to the chat with docs tool. I'm gonna hit generate. So now you can see the tool is giving me actual questions that I could ask the bill, but I'm gonna try something different. So here I'm gonna ask the doc, can you give me a basic outline of what the bill states and how it applies to me as a fifth grade teacher? And here you can see it's pulling from those documents the information that I need as a fifth grade teacher. So now I'm gonna ask assistance in creating an implementation guide for my fifth grade class. So here you can see it's breaking it down into different in integrations that I could do throughout the school year. So I'm asking Rainer to write a letter to the parents in my classroom telling them how this bill and best AI practices will affect my students. And just like that, this letter is being crafted, create nightly lessons for the parents of my classroom to engage in with their child based on these documents. I hope you found this video helpful. Please let me know in the comments if you have any questions. Thanks for watching.